Hi there, Cynthia Train here with another techniques video to pair with my kits and patterns. Today I want to share with you my feathering technique. As you can see here on the belly and barely see on the wings, this technique allows you to connect one piece of felt to another piece of felt seamlessly without any stitching. All right, so I think we'll start with this wing. Before we get started and take our pattern piece off of the felt, let's let's put a little pin here to mark this little tick and a little pin here to mark this little tick. And we're going to be using um, using a sewing needle here uh, to create our feathering. And the feathering is going to happen between these two points. So let's take this guy off and adjust my pin there a little bit. All right, let me get up nice and close. that you can see what's going on here. And I'm gonna start at the first pin. So I don't know if you can see this, but I've really, I'm just going right through the edge. This is the pointed end of the pin uh, needle I'm using. And I am basically just pulling out from the edge and letting those wool fibers be long and fluffy. And you want to just make all your little, all your little movements and you know, cuts into that edge with the needle point, very very close together, so that you, so that you can get an even, an even looking fluff on the edge. Now you're going to get some of these. You can probably see here. You'll get um, initially you'll get a little bit of an uneven look. You get these kind of pills. You can see you've got kind of thicker areas here. These we're just gonna, we're gonna pull out to make them smooth. You can do that all at the end as well. You don't have to do it during the process. So I'm gonna say we're probably going into the edge about a sixteenth of an inch here. And just pulling away to break up those fibers. Now you're going to do this for both wings on the bird to attach them and you're going to do this all the way around the circumference of the belly. All right, we're getting there. I'm going to move, move my pins at this point because we have the sort of the beginning and the end all set. And I'm just going to go back over the edge and make sure everything feels even and there are no gaps. When you're connecting a matching color, like the wing to the body, uh, these ga any gaps are less critical. Um, when you're doing the belly, when you're doing like the yellow that's going to be connected to the blue, you just want to make sure that that edge is really, really smooth. So you can just go back over it a couple of times. Okay, so now we're ready to um, apply this to another piece of fabric. I have a bottle of glue here. This is just Aileen's Tacky Glue, which is this. Uh, but I've sometimes I put it into a smaller bottle so that I can extend the life of a large bottle and it doesn't dry out. So, okay. So what we're going to do is take a little bit of glue and we're just going to put it on the back side of the sleeve. Put the glue bottle away. Sleeve. That's not a sleeve, that's a wing. All right, here we go. So then I'm going to take my finger and just lightly spread that glue. I don't know if you can see this here, but I'm kind of 
lightly, lightly, lightly spreading it out onto that feathered edge. Okay. So the back side of the feathering is going to be glued down to our other felt. Now I haven't tried it yet, but um, it's been recommended to me by one of my pattern testers that another glue that might work really well for this is Mod Podge. Um, I am definitely going to try that out and I'll get back to you on that. So here is my wing and it is laying on top of this sun colored felt and I'm gluing that right down. And you can see that that feathering creates this nice smooth transition of color between those two pieces of felt. So the next thing that we're going to do, and that's this is basically to finish uh, and smooth out and connect any of these top fibers, is to use a little bit of hairspray. I'm just going to clean off my hand. And I sometimes buy these little travel size hairsprays. Um, I'm not quite sure why I, I have this one that's an aerosol. I think my next bottle is going to be a non-aerosol. But uh, anyhow, I'm just going to do this right here. And can you see there's some little beads on the surface of the felt there? I just want to smooth that right out because those are going to dry. Um, those will dry out on the surface as, um, as kind of beads. Uh, but you want to blend them in. You want to blend the uh, liquid into the felt and then you will have everything will be nicely attached and the surface will have a nice finish on it. So that is it for the feathering technique and how you connect it to your felt. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.